Uh, Yandere, guest commentator, go. Rar. Rar. <laughs> so same deal as last time. You read girl voices because you do girl voices better yeah. than I do. Hopefully this one will actually record. No, it will. I decided to go full screen for my recording. Fuck that stuff. After finishing, I make Saki put on her clothes again. She seems ashamed and somehow happy as well. Ah, that felt good. I never imagined. I didn't have the chance to do it until now, but I could get addicted to this. After this, it wouldn't be so bad to do it with Saki once in a while. Even though she was just an annoyance until now, I could do it with her without difficulty in the future. <laughs> with this, I'm finally yours. Hell yeah, you ain't. Mm. <laughs> huh? What's she talking about? I was just playing around. I was only thinking of a sex friend. Nails. I'm glad, Subaru-chan. <laughs> I'm so happy. Ah, is that so? But you really should have home for today. Am I disturbing you slightly? Not really. Okay. Eh, I wanna sleep with you, Subaru-chan. You just did. Hey now, your parents are going to get worried, so for today, go home. Uh, okay, if you say so, I'll go back. Though she's still reluctant at my words, she starts to prepare to leave, although she'll probably come back later. I quickly pull the sex stained sheets from the bed and lay down on it. Oh, I say all of them sex stains like seeped through and stuff. Ah, I wonder how I'm going to do it with tomorrow, because I'm a pimp and a dick like that. Without thinking, I accidentally said that out loud. Shit, I should have said that louder though. Oh shit, did Saki hear me? I shut my mouth in a hurry and slightly peek at Saki's face, who's still here. Good night, Subaru chan. <laughs> <laughs> You're scaring me. Y yes, see you tomorrow. Saki leaves without saying another word. She seems to have made it home properly. Good. Looks like she didn't hear me just now. Damn, what an annoying woman. We did it once, and now she's acting like she's my girlfriend. Did I just step on a landmine? We did it once, and now she's acting like my girlfriend. Mm. Um. <laughs> yeah, just, just wait for Let me. factor in morals. Uh, Japan. Uh, that's right, I have to lock the doors properly before heading to bed. Uh, how annoying. But even so, it's not safe to sleep without locking all the doors. Hell ain't it, hell, hell no it ain't. In this neighborhood... <laughs> Well, whatever. Even if it's somewhat bothersome, I can do whatever I want for a while. I've got to endure at least this much. I leave the room to comfort to confirm for the last time that the lock doors are locked before finally going to bed. Subaru-chan! Subaru-chan! Wow. <laughs> what time is it? This early? So annoying. Hey, Subaru-chan! Subaru-chan! Music note. My body's being shaken by someone. Leave me alone. I want to sleep some more. It's not time to go yet. Subaru-chan! Subaru-chan! This is going to get so annoying by the end of the game if we pick Saki's route. <laughs> Shut up. Urged by the voice, I reluctantly open my eyes. So bright. Facing the morning light, I squint my eyes and lightly glare at the person before me. You're so annoying, Saki. Let me sleep some more. That's no good. Don't you want to? Don't you know there's school today? If you sleep in, you're gonna be late. Hell yeah, he will be. Saki's smiling face is peering at me. Somehow, looking at that face makes me sick. I only realize that he says that line now. After all. Yeah, he says that now. <laughs> Just wait till later. Even though all I want to do is sleep, she's still trying to make me up at this hour. Jeez, get up already, Subaru-chan. It's morning. Shut up. Come on, it's morning. Get up. Musical note. Saki starts to shake my body again. Ugh, stop it, Saki. But, but, you're not getting up at all, Subaru-chan. If you don't get up, you're going to be late for school. Saki puffs up her cheeks to show her discontent at my laziness. Damn it. Ah! Damn it. <laughs> First of all, you haven't woke me up like this in a long time. Why the sudden change? Since your mom isn't here, she asked me to take care of you, Subaru-chan. Worst mom ever. What? <laughs> what? When did she ask her that? By the way, how did she get into the house? Why happened to the locks? I thought I locked all the doors last night. 
Your mom also entrusted me with the key to the house. Didn't you hear about it, Subaru-chan? Ah, is that so? It's the first time I've heard about that, but more importantly, Mom sure is careless. She may be my childhood friend, but giving her key to the house? Well, whatever Saki says, so it must be true. Wow, you're you're a real gullible asshole, Subaru. <laughs> Fine then. <laughs> With that said, it's my duty to wake you up. So get up soon and let's go to school. Fine. So annoying. However, I can't talk back. As she says, if I don't get up soon, I won't make it to school in time. Uh, Good morning, Subaru Chan. <laughs> Sorry, I, was like, I forgot what to do on the black screen. <laughs> yeah, good morning. You were really annoying with your Subaru Chan, Subaru Chan, Subaru Chan just now, you know. Well, she's not going to stop saying that by the end of the game. Ah! Hmm? All of a sudden, Saki's face dies red as her gaze turns downward. Perverted woman. What is it now? Oh, Subaru Chan. Why are you looking? Your thing down there, Subaru Chan, it got big. Funny because penis. Huh? I thought it was that. Down there, it's gotten big due to a certain psychological phenomenon affecting the male sex of the human. Physiological species. phenomenon, not psychological. Face palm, face palm. My morning wood is really stretching my pants. English motherfucker, do you speak it? I might. Fight. <laughs> I joined with Subaru Chan last night, right? That's a very polite way to put it. I still feel like Subaru Chan is stuck down there. Uh, Saki says that while acting embarrassed. But it made me really happy because I love you, Subaru Chan. You better. Wait, no, that's a bad thing. Say, Saki, <laughs> how about you planning on standing there? Because the topic was heading in a troublesome direction, and I had to deliberately change it. Saki stares blankly at, uh, for, the, for a second at the interruption. Eh? I can't change with you here, so go wait for me in the living room. Ah, yeah, okay. Sorry, Subaru chan. Saki leaves the room with a smile on her face. She's probably heading to the kitchen. Last time I recorded this, I made a sexist joke. I'm not going to do that now. <laughs> Damn, <laughs> Damn, even though she can be cute sometimes, she depresses me. She's going to be a lot more than depressing. It seems like she misunderstood what happened yesterday. Well, I better change for now. Oh crap, now that I remember what happened yesterday, my morning wood won't be able to settle down easily. Shit. <laughs> 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 it's really not calming down. It may be a good idea to do Saki again tonight. Mm -hmm, maybe not. Ah, uh, Subaru Chan, breakfast is ready. God damn it, keep up with the recording. God, got it, thanks. When I head towards the living room, I see that breakfast is already been prepared for Saki. I begin eating immediately. Better for worse, it's times like this to show how really useful she's here. I'm really saved. Irony. Hey, Subaru Chan, is it good? It might be. Yeah, it's pretty delicious. You've gotten better at cooking recently, haven't you? <laughs> Mom has been teaching me lots of things. Like what? <laughs> <laughs> how to treat men? Because <laughs> if that's the case, you got a shit mom. I see. Well, when I become your wife, it'd be better to be good at cooking, right? She wants to become his wife? Well, that's, that escalated quickly. Well, it's better yeah, to be good at it than not. However, I don't think I'll be choosing Saki. Hell no! <laughs> but I won't tell her yet. If I don't ruin it, I could indulge in this for quite a while, just like a dream. That's some fucked up dream. Thanks for the meal. Well, we should head to school now, then. Can you wait for a minute? I have to wash the dishes. Hurry up then. In that case, I should go to the bathroom. Fap, fap, fap. I take care of my business while Saki washes the dishes, then we leave the house together. Fap, fap, fap. Judo kid. Fap, fap, fap. <laughs> Sex noise as much? <laughs> <laughs> You're in a good mood, Saki. Well, it's our first morning after we join. So polite. I see. Saki states that happily, but I was not so careful. <coughs> She's so naive. There's also a legend that says a person changes after the first time. Really? Really? Is Saki being affected by that? Well, I feel like I changed a little after doing it with her, too. Like the sun is brighter than usual. Wait, that's just a lack of sleep. Bad joke. <laughs> Bad joke. Jeez. Well, by the way, what's for lunch? Uh, sorry, Subaru chan. I overslept this morning and couldn't make your lunch. Oh, it's alright. I don't really mind. 
I had trouble sleeping last night. After all, Subaru Chan and I. Yeah, I get it already. You don't have to say any more. Still, no lunch today. Mom always makes me lunch for that. I thought, depending on sake for even that much was futile. Having said that, is there any way I can make sure I can have a lunch? My parents give me a decent amount of money, so splurging on lunch should be okay. Hmm? That's. What is it, Subaru Chan? I just saw someone I know. Hold on for a sec. Ah, Subaru Chan! I rush over to that acquaintance, leaving Saki behind. See you later, Biatch! Hey, my god! Eh? She shakes a little out of fear and surprise before turning around. She's a cute girl, though her expression shows glimpses of fear. Her adult figure is good. When she notices with me who greeted her, her expression calms down. Senpai, good morning. Yeah, good morning, Micah. You going to school? Ah, guess that's obvious. <laughs> Yes, that's right. You're in high spirits today, Senpai. I just want to point out right now, Super's a real dumbass. Yeah, well, yeah. I guess you can say I'm feeling pretty good today. <clears throat> because my libido has calmed down a little. When I'm thinking that, my just shyly glances behind me. It seems like Saki is quickly catching up to me. Senpai, how about eating lunch together again today? Before Saki reaches me, I quietly, I quietly whisper to Micah, I don't have time for our lunch for... I... Shit! I don't... <laughs> Today. It's fine. I prepared a lunch today for you as well, Senpai. Really? Then I'll gracefully accept your offer. Alright. Then I'll be waiting for you during lunch. We are so good at acting, by the way. Yes, we are. With that said, she quietly distanced her herself from me, acting as if nothing happened. I turned towards Saki. Saburu chan, leaving me behind was mean. I didn't leave you behind. I waited here for you, didn't I? Good morning, Miyachi Senpai. Oh, Saito-san, good morning. A little scared, Micah greets Saki. Saki returns to the greeting while sulking. Saito Micah, she's our underclassman by a year. Some time ago, I helped her when she was being bullied by our classmates. And that's how I got to meet her. What a weird way to meet someone. Hmm. Because she was bullied, she's a gloomy, intimate personality, as well as the atmosphere. <sighs> well, she's cute, so that doesn't matter to me. Yeah, so are the women in school days and shit, but you know, they're fucking <laughs> weird. Yeah, fuck their personalities. I just go for the pussy. <laughs> but most of all, her figure is better than Saki's. How rude. Subaru Chan, you're so mean. As if predicting what he just thought. Exactly. <laughs> I get it, I get it. So stop clicking on to me. Clicking? Clinging on to me. Saki outwardly locks her arms between mine. Is she jealous? We were just talking. Looking at Saki, Maki, Mi Maka? Micah smiles faintly, reducing the tension. As you know, I'm not good at reading. Sorry to interrupt, Senpai, but shouldn't we be heading to school? At this rate, we're going to be late. Yeah, that's right. Saki, get off! It's hard to walk like this. Come on, we need to get to school. <laughs> <laughs> and so begins the moo count. Reluctantly, she lets <laughs> The movement? Wow! What? Did you really just say that? The moo count, yes. I'm gonna have one oh, of them. Oh, I thought you said the movement. No. Reluctantly, <laughs> she lets go and starts walking... Uh, by my side. Micah doing the same. The two of them walk alongside me slowly. Is Saki worried about Micah? She's been giving her quick glances for a while now. Just as I expect from Micah, she acts uncomfortable under Saki's glances. Though I guess Saki's just being the same as usual. Whenever a girl will approach me, I'd watch her just... She'd watch her just like this. I've known Micah for a long time now. As Saki suspects, she's interested in me. Either way, going to school with a beautiful girl on either side feels pretty good. I wish I knew that. And so, we, mainly Saki and I, head to school, chatting along the way. Transition. Senpai, it's about time. I... Okay, got it. Good luck in class. Entering the school, we walk through the corridors. Micah's classroom's on a different floor than ours, since she's an underclassman. We walk together into the middle of a corridor, and then Saki and I part from Micah. Well then, this is goodbye, Senpai. Goodbye too, Miyachi-senpai. Yeah. Bye-bye, Saito-san. Let's hurry, super chan Don't pull me. See ya, Micah. After giving a small bow, Micah heads to her classroom, and then the fucking glitch happens. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like, it's just Micah's sprite permanently on the screen. The one that I don't get. <laughs> yeah, because you're, you've got a good copy of the game that took, like, two weeks for you to fuck about with. <laughs> okay, let's head to our class, too. Yep. Music note. And yay, it's this bitch. Your favorite character. Uh, sit down, everyone. Homeroom is starting now. This is, by the way, I say this is your favorite character. Shh. No. 
<laughs> the bell sounds, and after a brief moment, the teacher in charge of the phone room comes in. The attendants. It looks like nobody's absent. I assume nobody will be late either, then. Well, that's a good teacher, then. <laughs> she, she starts to look around the class. Her eyes stop and they meet mine, and she smiles to the confusion of other people. I just noticed, call me a pervert, but I noticed on her sprite that, like, her shirt is really tight. And you She's can, propping her boobs up. Yeah, yeah, and you can see, like, the cleavage line. Yeah. <laughs> pervert. <laughs> although, oh, <laughs> although that's normal for her. Kikushita Yumi, she's the Hi. Jack. She's the Japanese teacher in charge of this class. <laughs> she's as young as she looks and as a result hasn't been appointed to this school for long. Because of her looks and figure, she's popular. Some students even call her Yumi-chan. Although she doesn't look like that very much. That's it for the morning announcements. Does anyone have any questions? When do I get my lunch break? Once again, Yumi scans the class. But no. Never! Fuck you! But nobody raises their hand. Seeing that no one has a question, she gives a big nod. It's wonderful that nobody has questions. Well then, first period is Japanese. I'll begin class now. I'm gonna stop right here. Isn't it bad for a teacher to say that it's no that it's good that no one has questions? Yes, it is bad for a teacher to say. Well, she's an amazing teacher then. Oh, while you reset the recording, I'm gonna go get myself more water. <laughs> oh yeah, I'm gonna cut here. Shit.